It's all good YouTube, it is night! And welcome to Grey Wolf Fitness. And today we're talking changing your training when you get over 40. But first, a big shout out to Rob from Shed for Life. Do you like the channel, brother? And you're racing against Rocky Balboa. That's why I've got the Rocky Balboa t shirt on, brother. Paying homage. Great vid. Go check out Rob's channel. Shed for Life. You won't be disappointed. Right, back on to, to today's vid. We've got Caramon Sue, she's just coming in from work. Woo. See? <laughs> so what did I change in the past year getting back into half decent shape for me? Well for starters, the training that I was doing, I was doing a typical bro split, training five days a week, arms, legs, back, chest, that sort of thing. Not doing much cardio. So last year, about this time last year, wasn't really seeing any results. I'd ballooned up to about 250 odd pound. That was in it. That was enough. Wanted to change. So what did I change to start with? Got rid of arm day. Oh my god, he got rid of arm day. Now I know that sounds daft because you've seen me doing all these bicep challenges and whatnot. Well that's not a typical week's training at all. So we've got rid of arm day, so we've reduced it down to four days. I do train biceps and triceps but only with maybe one at the most two exercises at the end of a workout. What else have we done differently? Well we've even gone one step further in the second week we just do compound exercises, sort of training the body as a whole, as a, as a, as a unit let's say. That's the one thing I've found getting into my 40s, because I'm 44 next month. I know I don't look it. Even... <coughs> Were you choking then? Yeah. You better not be. You said the other day I was looking better as I got older. Yeah, so what did you start off as? Like? I know. <laughs> Can you imagine that? I'm Where gonna, was I anyway? I'm what? gonna dig one of your your old photos out, I think, and uh, put it as a, a thumbnail on your on one of your vids. Fab. <laughs> <laughs> With your long hair and your your pot belly and your double chin. <sighs> Super. <laughs> right, you got me off track now. Where was I? All oh, right, yeah. Training the body as a whole. That's the one thing I've really found beneficial to me getting into my forties is training the body as a whole. Going back to years gone by when you used to train the whole body three days a week, doing just sort of one compound exercise per part of your body. Dips, shoulder presses, that sort of thing. So the first week we train four days and it's a bit of a body, body part split, yeah. Back, biceps, shoulders, triceps, chest, so, so on and so forth. Then the second week Compound week, like I say. Third week, we're having a bit of fun. We're doing the supersets. Throwing in all sorts of different exercises, having a bit of fun. That's the one thing I do like to do for myself now, is make training fun, not a chore. Back into the fourth week, back to a compound week, but doing different compound exercises in that week than the first compound week. And then the fifth week, I'm just doing a two day a week routine, just two exercises. Now, you, if you've been watching my channel, I used to do that last year, leading up to Christmas. But I've pushed it to the fifth week now. I find that bit, even more variation, and I'm getting to the fifth week where I feel I need a rest. So, the fifth week is a sort of a deload week, but I still... I still go at it, six or seven sets of deadlifts, six or seven sets of dips on the first week, first week, first routine, second routine of the week is front squats, six or seven sets of those, then six or seven sets of chins, all different um, variations of hand grip. Another thing I've changed, rest periods. Have a conscious stopwatch with you on rest periods. I was stuck in a traffic jam the other day and I was right opposite a gym. Could see in and I watched some a, a, 
pair of uh, lads training and I timed them and it was eight minutes in between sets for two exercises, for two sets sorry, eight minutes, good god, I'm, su I'm surprised uh, the workout didn't take three hours, eight minutes, so be conscious of the rest periods in between your sets. So what else am I doing differently soon? More cardio. More cardio. Got back running. That was the one thing that's really hard for me. I'm not uh, cardiovascular. What's the word, Sue? Orientated. Is it? Orientated. That's a cracking word. That yeah. I'm not cardiovascular orientated. So it's took me a long time to build up my cardiovascular. Fitness. So fitness. Sorry. So, my cardiovascular, I run to work. That's as simple as that. Yeah, but you've also got a manual job. And I've also got a manual job. Thank you, Sue. You're not like us, I'm sat at a desk most of the day. You're I'm not sat me fat when I'm alive. No. No, you're lugging kegs of I'm beer. I'm lugging beer barrels. Yeah, and crates and And crates and of beer. Whatever. That's why the big fella loves a beer, especially on a Saturday <laughs> night. No, you need a beer. I need a beer. <laughs> Don't say because you were cameraman say whatever you do. So I these five bottles of wine on. <laughs> Shush. So these small changes have helped me slowly but surely getting back to a reasonable shape for me. I'm quite happy with uh, the look I've got at the moment. Weighing about just under 220 pounds. I vary between 218 to 220 at the moment. I'm doing a little bit of a cut because we're going on holiday in about uh, three months time to Florida and guess what the big fella's gonna scream like a girl going on them theme rides so on that note don't forget to like subscribe what else babe comment share hit and the notification bell. hit that notification bell wherever it is whether it's up there or down there give it a hit I'll catch you later